If you're standing right here and you look straight back that way, tell me that does not look like a person standing there. What's up everybody, my name is CJ Faison. First and foremost, welcome back to another brand new Nautica adventure. I got Kevin, we're still out here in the desert. Jazz and Chris are on the other side of Tonopah. We're filming, we're trying to get as much content for all of you as possible, and mainly we're trying to get more answers. That's what this whole thing is about. Now if you hear the wind, it's because, as you can see behind us, we have the most beautiful desert plains, in my opinion, of Tonopah, Nevada. We're just out here looking, this is incredible looking, but, um, the view is cool. We're continuing on today with our Random Nautica adventure. Now, number one thing that I have to let everybody know about um, was, uh, as you all saw uh, in the last part, my camera battery died. We were running out of gas. Um, it, it was just it was, it was a, a lot of confusion, so we did cut the night early. That's why Jazz and Chris were looking for us for so long. Um, but again, uh, they were an area where uh, the reception, I guess, was really spotty because I only have one missed call from Jazz. So um, it went back, went to sleep, kind of regrouped. So uh, long story short, I, I got a little bit of hate for like, why did you guys leave Jazz out there and stuff? I text Jazz several times and just did not go through. So um, I kind of wanted to put that out there. Uh, I would not leave my friends abandoned like that. And um, it just, we're, we're all grown men. We're, we're okay. So at the end of the video, I kind of felt like we were a little bit closer to getting answers. And again, I put in that last video that I've done nothing to Jules. I've done nothing to Aaron. I don't even know Aaron. I don't know Clyde. I don't know anyone except for Julia. And I haven't spoke to her since 2014. So um, I'll be honest with you, I don't even know if I still have her number. I've had so many new phones. So that's, you know what I mean? She has no social media seven, accounts at all. Seven years is a long time. That's a very long time. Like seven years, you should be over whoever it is. You should be gone and, and that's out of your mind and out of your life at that point in time. But um, so again, I, I really want to reiterate that I've not talked to Julia. I don't, I, again, I really doubt I even have her phone number. I haven't even looked at that, but um, I'm gonna look that up. And, I, and again, I don't want to say her last name. Um, and I don't know if she got remarried and her last name is Ketterman, but um, I know she's like super anti social media and all that kind of stuff. You know, I have three or three Julias. That's it. Of course you do. <laughs> so without any further ado, guys and girls, go to shopmotivated.com. See the shirt that Kevin's wearing. That is on sale right now. So go take advantage of that before they're all gone in the hat. I believe we only have less than like 20 of these left. So go get them all left. The wind is blowing. Let's go, baby. We're here. All right, everybody, before we get into this video, go to shopmotivated.com. I'm telling you all right now, the new drop just happened. We have new flags and we have the rise and grind. We also have the palms edition flag that is really, really cool and very unique. Also material they're made out of as well. But better yet, the Whiskey Throttle Tour, which we're on right now out here in Nevada, the shirts are now available on the website. So use promo code HOT for 15% off. Now, once again, as most of you know, my company Motivated, once everything is sold out, we never bring anything back again. So that style that you see right now that you really, really love, recommend getting it. So now, back to the video. All right, so we're gonna start off our first intent today. Comes from Kim Stanway. Uh, Kim says, forgotten treasure objects. Lost, aliens and UFOs, I like that. Mysterious abandoned farms, forgotten cemetery, highway killers, mysterious lonely highway accidents. That's kind of creepy Ooh. too. Woman in white looking for child, Eesh. leprechauns. Okay, if we see a, a damn leprechauns. leprechaun, we see a leprechaun out here, your boy CJ uh, might pass out and die right here. That's I'm called hallucin yeah, hallucinating. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so I tell you what, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go with highway killers. Great. I like it. Let's fire up the Random Nautica app here. Generate ourselves a location. Let's see what we got working. Beautiful sky. 
Holy shit, 7.2 miles. 25 minute drive. 7.2 miles. 25. We're on a dirt road, so I guess it only makes sense. So let's get going, folks. All right, this thing took us to the salt flats out here, but I'm not sure where to go. Like, it's literally salt flats everywhere that you look. It's really cool. It is, and it is. It's kind of scary, really. It's... All right, this thing's telling me to turn left. It, we're supposed to be walking, technically, I think, is because it's just like there's no road that it's like picking up on. Okay. Uh, right down the here. Like this is kind of what I'm looking at, that little thing, but there's no way to tell where exactly it's talked about. site or something or okay um we gotta turn this way I, this is like impossible to like know where you're at i've never been on a salt flat before and this is huge it's... all right this is confusing it looks like we're headed straight for it okay we're getting close Wait, it says it's like right in front of a slope, like we're right on top of a point. Okay. You just want to get out? I, get, I mean, I'm guessing so. I mean, short of that being what we're looking for, I really don't know what, I mean, the thing I do like about this though, is let's just say, all right, theoretically, if someone was out here trying to do harm to us, oh shit, I didn't think about that either. This would probably be the perfect place to do it, but we're wide open. And if anybody can take a shot from one of those mountains, which has got to be probably 40, 50 miles away, you deserve it. But also, if there is somebody out here, we're going to see them. Because at this point, you have to just let me do a quick 360 here for everybody. Oh man. Okay, this might be another bus, dude. 100, 100 foot radius. It's like there's, oh dude, look at this. Looks like a, almost like a grave. Oh, Kevin! One of them canisters, bro. Remember that canister from last night? Yes. Look at that. That's exactly what that is. Dude, it is. Here, here, okay. here, here, here. All right, first off. Okay, that thing is stuck in the ground. Uh -huh. Is that hot? Okay, that's not the same one. Okay, no. Obviously, because I took that. That's like a flower. That's like a flower looking thing, and the other one was heart shaped. Out in the middle of this place. Joker. Joker card, whatever. It's got a number 31 on the bottom of it. Is that number three? Room 31 from the other night in Vegas. Remember, it had underlined room 31. And that's a creepy picture. Who's that Who guy? That? I have no idea. Who's that guy? I have no clue. That's weird. Out the, middle, in there. out the middle of these salt flats. What the hell? Where would... And the wind just died down. Yeah. Damn, I need sunglasses. I own a sunglass company and don't even have a pair of sunglasses. 
Let's listen. Let's just listen for a second and see if we can hear anybody. The wind has died down. Hello? What is up with this guy? I don't understand. Who's the guy in the picture, dude? I have no idea. If you all knew who that guy in the picture was, comment below, let me know. Um, the Joker. Hang on one second. Kevin, look at that. If you're standing right here and you look straight back that way, tell me that does not look like a person standing there. Hang on, let me try and zoom in. Man. Already? Okay, hang on. Right in between. Yeah, 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 right in between. Yep, yep, yep. You see that? Yes. Bend down some, dude. Is that somebody watching us then? Look. Huh. Look over here. Look straight ahead. That's one of those like, tornado things, I think. Oh, yeah, I see that now. Can we both agree this is a little bit creepy? It's, it went from really cool, as I mentioned when we got here, to more wide open. Do you want me to hold that? Yeah. Now why does that feel this way? It's hot out here. Yeah, no, why it's, does that feel? And it's cold, blistering cold. That's why I asked you to be careful, it's hot, and it was hot. It's written in yeah, Nevada. it's cold. It, 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 it actually kind of feels good. Like I'm sweating out here right now, but that's cold. See if you can find anything else around the area, man. Like, are we missing something? Are there more of those containers? Now it got real spooky. This is, this is not hot at all. I wanted to, uh, wanted to kind of, I'm gonna bring the mood down for just a brief second here. I'm just gonna kind of walk around a little bit bigger of a radius. Kev, okay, start to walk around a little bit near, like maybe over towards that way of the car. Let's just see if we can see anything. I, uh, before my dad passed away, I wanted to take my dad to this salt flat that was right outside of Las Vegas. Um, he'd never seen the salt flats or anything along those lines, so. Um, Although we're, we're kind of in a weird situation right now where it's just Kevin and I out here, Chris and Jazz, they, I have no idea where they're at. They're, um, that road right up that mountain there, I don't know if you all can see that, but that road right there is where we came down off of. And um, you know, I really wanted to take my dad to a salt flat, so I kind of just feel like he's here with me at least, kind of joining along for the video. And, and I wish we could be sitting side by side just kind of looking at this. Um, you know, and, and this is a message to whoever let us out there, like, we have lives, we're, we're normal human beings, we film YouTube videos and stuff, but at the end of the day, we're normal. What is that? That's another one of those tornado things, I think, dude. Dude, there's something white sticking out over here. I don't know what it is, but I can see it really clear in the distance. You see it over there? It's near that bush. Yes, yeah, it's Yep. I don't know, but I caught it, I caught it out of the corner of my eye. What the hell is that thing?
you ain't kidding we're a little bit further away from comfort zone i can tell you that much we're stupid for doing this shit got in the car it's my fault man i just started walking is that water it is water looks like there's water straight ahead oh man hmm. yo pvc pipe kevin no no i swear to you bro Yep. It's got some holes in it. I, I'm just gonna say this, I'm a little nervous to like kick that thing. What is that beside it? Looks like a person beside that mini, that mini tornado. It's maybe it's maybe gonna freak it out. Yeah, we should go down there to it. Look how big that little thing is. That's nuts. Alright, so some behind the scenes here. I'm naked up under this thing, and uh, you can use this as multi-purpose towel, flag, what have you. Hey! <laughs> Shoot. Come on, we gotta go. Are you being for real? There's someone over. Like, let's go to like a different side or something. You see him walking? No. What's the one funny tire videos? Tire huh? Look at our tire tracks. Looks straight back there. There's somebody walking towards us. Hang on, hang on. Don't get in the car if they're serious, man. Come on. Can you see it? Yeah. All right, let's go. Let's go, dude. Let's okay. All right, that turned. That turned weird really quick. You run around naked and they come flying up and say they saw someone. I know. I, I, I haven't been that scared in a long time. Holy shit! I just thought they were messing with me at first. Good grief! What am I doing? Oh my gosh! What are we doing? I have no idea, dude. Oh my god! All right. Holy shit, man. I was trying to do a photo shoot for all the motivated clothing and then they come up and uh, good grief. You good? We need to change it up a little bit because we have been going bust after bust after bust after bust and we've used so many good intents and nothing has happened. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Little stops. Seven busts so far. Um, uh, again, I, I, I really think that you all really need to dive deep into Random Nautica and, and do it yourself sometimes. And you'll learn that not every location you go to, you're going to get something. I preach that in my videos because I don't want you all being disappointed. But at the same time, when you put the work in like we're doing right now, 8, 10, 12 hour days, 15 hour days, 18 hour days. Um, we've spent 18 hours almost every single day here in the desert uh, filming, 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 filming just to hopefully have three or four videos, maybe five, maybe six, who knows. Um, but I, I really, really, really want to reiterate that it takes time and you're not going to find something everywhere that you go. Now, we're going to use Rando Nautica. We're not going to say a single intent or anything along those lines. We have now made our way, we've kind of snaked our way down to like the Goldfield area. Um, Goldfield is an area, I think there's 
only a couple hundred people it's living in the city. This big. It, it is. You're gonna blink, boom, miss it, and you're gone. A few, um, few buildings, a few few cars, a lot of stones. Yeah, tons of stones and a lot of dirt and big mountains. Yeah. So at the end of the day, uh, you know, not much going on here. So hopefully, uh, geez, hopefully the locals don't try to kill us or something. And I can verify for a lot of stops that we've been doing. <laughs> It's not easy for me to get in and out of the car. Yeah, Kevin has a little bit of trouble yeah, getting in and out. out, in and out, in and out Kevin's out, like, oh out, my out. gosh, not again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh man. But uh Yeah, we've done a lot of walking today. I bet we've been and yesterday. Yeah, yesterday was a four. lot of walking. A lot, a lot of walking. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and generate an intent that is nothing. So wait, if we generate an intent that's nothing, what if we find nothing? We is would a, just waste some time. Is it a win? I, I guess. I don't know. All right, start journey here. Let's see where uh, Google Maps is taking us here. Okay. All right, 2.7 miles away from here. Not bad. It's not hateful. I'm not walking it. I wouldn't recommend walking 2.7 miles, not in the desert at least. Like if you want to do that, be my guest, but. It's warm. Yeah, it's it's uh it's getting a hot. Whoo! All right, everybody. Since it's hot, we're gonna keep it hot. Go to shopmotivated.com right now. <laughs> if you haven't already, use a promo code either Vegas or Hot. Just put in there Hot. We're getting fifteen percent off right now because I'm sweating my ass off. That just happened. It just happened, baby. Woo! All right. I know exactly where this thing's taking us. I literally hate this seatbelt. This is the uh, this is the international car forest here. Wow. Sonny and I actually came here at night one time, and uh, I got I to basically say it's it's creepy. I've never seen anything like this. It's it's like definitely it. creepy. That's for sure. What the hell? Is that like a? Is that supposed to be like a? Uh, uh, you know, like a headstone? Uh, no, I just think it's like weird art. Why is there? Okay, there's people down here, dude. Yeah. Okay, I feel a little bit better then. If there's people. Yeah. Look at that. It's just wanting us to drive through us all. Alright, I think these people are friendly, right? Yeah, they're just yeah. taking pictures. Yeah, we're, we're at good. The car force too. We're good. We're good. This is wild, man. There's a bus all the way in the corner. That's literally where it's taking us. It's like kind of taking us over to that area. Oh wait, no, no, it's not. Hang on. Uh, Whoa. it's the limo. That is a limo up there. On like the top of a food truck. All right, let me pull over here. Maybe, those people didn't really look very suspect, did they? No, no, they didn't look like they was enjoying the car for us. Well, let's do this. Let's just get out. Look around. I don't care what anybody says. This is a little creepy, though. And I came. That's when Sunny and I came. It was at night. And I. What the hell? Okay. That's kind of what I was feeling too, because it like the point was literally right on, right on top of the bus. Oh really shit! I'm really feeling drawn to get in this. Ooh. Make sure there ain't no damn spiders or nothing. You know what I mean? see here is there uh oh dude look oh, oh, oh. it 
says we are everywhere. If you all know what that, that, I guess that's a gang sign or something, or I don't know, some type of demonic symbol, or I have no idea, comment below right now if you know what that is. What does that mean? And what kind of sign is that? Because I've, I've, I've never seen anything like that before. Because everything- And that looks fresh. All this other stuff does not look real. Really everything else you see is just people's names, fun stuff, and like, you know, nothing. Yeah, 2020 Ricky. If I'm seeing, if I'm missing something, comment below, let me know. see if I'm missing anything, anything at all. I think if our intent was nothing, this is a bunch of nothing. If you really think about it, like this is a bunch of nothing, so I mean. I don't know. I kind of feel like that has something to do with this, but then again, I feel like a big part of me, sorry about this wind, a big part of me thinks, no, not really, because we didn't really have an intent. And I, I will say this, things have kind of calmed down since just last night I, I feel like today hasn't had like that crazy moment except for on salt flats out there so what do you all think um, I'm keeping I'm paying very close attention to those people um, those people behind me I don't know what they're doing they're probably just taking pictures I'm not gonna freak out but I need you all to comment below what's your all's opinion what do you think is happening today Give me your thoughts on today. Not not necessarily all of what's happening within Randonautica and us playing and all of this. I'm talking about what's your theory about when Jazz and Chris saw that guy walking towards them. And uh, I just think it's really, really sus. I really, really think so. So it's my opinion at least for what it's worth. Looks like there's another bus up here, some cars and such. I actually, I, originally I thought the point was uh, the bus up here, but I was looking at the map, I was scrolled out too far. But um, I parked all the way back there. Now, I have a video that I have never dropped. Never dropped. It's kind of just sitting in the bank for one day when I don't have anything to upload. I'm gonna upload this. Sonny and I took a trip here to the car forest and uh, I actually went inside of this this cave right here and uh, oh my gosh what the hell was that So, uh, go ahead, comment below what you all think, but um, I'm kind of confused right now. This doesn't, doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Cool bus though, really cool bus. Okay, Kevin just saw something here, and maybe we're within a 100 foot radius of that bus. Never, re never reveal your, your identity, oh my gosh. That there, that could be a sign of some sort. That's why I 
didn't want to interrupt you while you were over there. I didn't find anything over there. No, not really. <sighs> All right, Kev. Well, um, it's hot. It's hot. It's dry. It's frustrating. Uh, Rando Nautica is dry for cars are three quarters of cool. Yeah, yeah, cars are cool. Yeah. Saw a couple um, of messages that could mean, you know. Yeah, I mean, there's some messages that maybe could have related to the intent or just kind of what we're doing here in general, you know, playing Rando Nautica. Um, but identity is best not revealed, or what was that? What the hell is that flying around our head? Is that a horsefly? <sighs> they have bees out here or no? I don't know. I don't know I've never been out here. I know they got scorpions and I know they have snakes and neither one of them do I like very much. So we'll do that. And they got both. Um, yeah. So I'll tell you what, we are going to go to Twitter. Geraldine, Geraldine uh, on Twitter says, Hi CJ, some random nautica intent. Childhood memory, Ooh. love, weird, positive, random nautica, out of place, unknown, unknown answers, uh, mystery, clown, stalker. We did the clowns. What could, possibly, what could possibly go wrong if we pick clowns? I'm just saying, I'm not going to pick clowns because I, if I, I, I will say, if I saw a clown right just start now, running, right now, running oh, like right down the road or something, that I would, oh man, It'd do me, I might pass out in fear. I might be um, I'm going to say this. Let's go with mystery. So, random nautica. It's all a mystery anyway. All of it is a mystery, so at this point it's very vague, but I mean, let's figure out the mystery. That's what this whole thing's about. Like, So all of you who have been watching the videos and supporting the channel, I appreciate that very, very much. Um, all right, look here. We got a generated point on Rando Nautica. Start journey, open up in maps. And uh, looks to me like we are... Point. Yeah. Point six miles away, so just over a half of a mile away. All right, hang on, which direction so that way I can... Oh, shit, it's behind us. It's so a bit this way. It's a little bit dry. Very dry. All right, folks, let's do it. Oh, wow, we got an intersection. Jeez, this is a first for us. And we're supposed to turn left. All right, cool. Point two miles up here on uh what's this on the left? What's this up here? Okay, that's where we're supposed to go apparently. Uh what is that? Whoa! What is okay. that? Is that a house? Is that like a broken house or something? Right down in the middle. Rusted up. Uh more more, more vehicles. Yeah. Jeez, dude, we're six, eight miles from the car forest. Looks like a little truck cap. Well, look at this thing. Damn. And we're here? Yeah, I mean, I'm probably 20 feet past the point, but okay. I just wanted to put that on camera. That's crazy looking, dude. And this mystery? Mystery, yeah. Well, here it is. <laughs> it's, a, it's a damn mystery why this is out here. Six, eight miles away from the car forest. Damn, that's crazy. Uh, that looks like an old mine. Okay. Hang on, there's something out here. I don't know, there's something reflecting. Alright, never mind. I can already tell it's a beer can. You good? Big ass. Like mosquito or something. So, I think ultimately this is a mystery of why these are here now. So is that mosquito? I hear the mosquito fly thing. I'm, I'm pretty sure that this thing probably has... Listen, listen. That's an airplane. Um, but I'm pretty sure this is this has got to be a mystery of first off why this is here. Let's go over here, check this thing out. But first, I, this stupid fly, damn, pain in the ass. This thing's got to out. Thing bit me. Yeah. This thing's got to have a thousand 
thousand bullet holes in it. You know what I mean? So it's a mystery of how they got here, mystery of why they're here. Yes, thing is too. Damn. It stinks out too. You ain't kidding. It stinks. Oh! Whoa! whoa what the? F the f bro. Oh! The f guy right there, Kevin, get in the f car. You bitch! Get in the car, Kevin. Kevin, get in the car. I'm just Come on, start this mother. So no, I'm no, going. No. Damn, Kevin. Holy f shit! Look, the f guy's right back there. No, no. Look at no. him. Look at him. He's still back there. Oh my gosh. I twisted my ankle, but I don't care. Oh my god, dude. Holy shit. That was a good shot. So you're at the end of our trip, right? But things have not stopped. I'm filming this back in Delaware right now. And I can assure you that there are more videos that are, it's, it's not stopping. I, I, at, at one point I thought, hey, this is over with. It's, it's good, you know, hey, we got the shit scared out of us and the Valentinos are going and doing their own thing. Well, that's not really the case right now. So what's happened is this. Um, I'm gonna kind of put this in a nutshell and wrap up this video. There's some things that you don't know. So the laptop, a lot of people have been commenting, CJ, What's going on with the laptop? Was there anything on it? Yada, yada, yada. That's gonna be over in my vlog channel. Link is in the description. Go check that out right now. That video will be posted tomorrow. So uh, that's really all I have to say for that. I'm not gonna really bust your all's bubble there, um, but there, it, it was weird. It was very, very weird. And not to mention, I kind of put together some of the things about the notes and things like that. So with that being said, I got to kind of recap this video. So obviously I was taking a funny photo shoot in the middle of the salt flats and that's when Jazz and Chris come rolling up to us really, really fast. And uh, you know, they're like, dude, there's a guy with a gun, yada, yada, yada. I am starting to think that that guy with the gun is the same person that has been there. It was a white baseball hat. We continued to see a white baseball hat from even the part one that we filmed out there. There was a gentleman in a baseball hat in the distance. You can clearly see someone in the distance with a white baseball hat on. So that had us on high alert. When Jazz and them started rolling up, I'm thinking to myself, I'm like, ah, they're messing with me. You know what I mean? I was doing a funny photo shoot for Motivated. Y'all will see that here in the coming weeks or maybe a month or so. But, um, you know, I, I was not naked, first of all. I was in my boxers. And uh, I just thought it was gonna be a funny photo shoot. I've seen girls with like the flags and all that kind of stuff. I just wanted to imitate that, but that's about it. Um, Getting serious here. <sighs> I don't even know where to start. Um, this is not the only time I have been shot at. It's fairly common. Now you're in the desert. I don't believe that we were on anyone's private property. If we were, then I apologize. But uh, I need you all to understand one thing that this entire situation that we're in has not stopped. It has not stopped at all. And when I thought it was ending, it was just beginning. And that's, that's what's so confusing to me is like, I, you know, in one aspect, I'm thinking, all right, cool, we're in the clear, we're good, we're clear. And now it's not. And there are there is an organization um, that is very powerful that I feel kind of has um, something to do uh, with, with all of this that's going on. And it's kind of hard for me to speak on. I don't want to ruin the next video for all of you, but um, you know, the other night we were filming and we found some wild stuff back here in Delaware. Now, prior to that, we had filmed three or four days straight and we have had nothing, nothing. It was what I call dry nights. There was nothing. We found nothing. There was nothing creepy. There was no one that stalked us or nothing. So when I, when I try to, to come across on camera and not ruin the next video, it's really, really tough. But these next couple of videos after this one here, I can guarantee you are some of the craziest videos that you will watch. So stay tuned, be a part of the action. Follow me on Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, all of that good stuff. Links are in the description. I just wanna say I love you all so much. And if you would like to, go to shopmotivated.com, check out all the new threads that are coming out. I really appreciate it. Love y'all so much and I'll see y'all on the next video.